the camera industry was shaken in early 2024 when Nikon acquired RED, the renowned US-based cinema camera company, for a surprisingly modest $85 million. This acquisition, sparked by a patent infringement lawsuit, has opened up a world of possibilities for Nikon in the realm of professional videography. As the dust settles on this groundbreaking deal, rumors are swirling about a potential game-changing product, the Nikon Komodo Z. Let's know more about this one. The acquisition came at a crucial time for Nikon, as the company's president, Yoshiaki Tokunari, recently emphasized the growing importance of video performance in the camera market. Tokunari expressed Nikon's intention to expand its market share by incorporating RED's video technology into its products. This strategic move aligns perfectly with the current trends in the industry, where the lines between still photography and cinematography are increasingly blurred. While official announcements regarding new products are yet to be made, industry insiders and enthusiasts are buzzing with speculation about what a Nikon Komodo Z might offer. The potential fusion of RED's cinematic expertise with Nikon's renowned imaging capabilities could result in a truly revolutionary camera. Drawing from RED's latest technological advancements, we can make some educated guesses about the Nikon Komodo Z's capabilities. RED's most recent release, the Komodo X, boasts impressive specifications, including 4K video capture at up to 120 frames per second in 12-bit RAW. It's reasonable to expect that the Nikon Komodo Z would match or exceed these specifications. One of the most anticipated features is the integration of Nikon's Z-mount system. This would mark a significant shift from RED's previous use of Canon's RF mount for their face detection autofocus system. The Z-mount could potentially offer enhanced autofocus capabilities, leveraging Nikon's advanced algorithms and RED's existing face detection technology. The sensor is another area of intense interest. RED has been using 20 megapixel global shutter Super 35 mm sensors developed in partnership with Tower Jazz. Interestingly, Nikon and Tower Jazz have a long standing relationship, which could lead to even more advanced sensor technology in the Nikon Komodo Z. There's speculation that we might see improved global shutter performance and possibly even 8K video capabilities. Another exciting prospect is the potential for new RED video recording formats optimized for Nikon's systems. This could result in more efficient compression and higher quality footage. Additionally, there's talk of Nikon developing cinema lenses specifically for the Z-mount, complete with T-stops, further enhancing the camera's appeal to professional cinematographers. However, it's important to temper expectations with reality. Both Nikon and RED have made it clear that significant changes won't happen overnight. A recent Facebook post from Nikon emphasized that RED's current product lineup, partnerships, and dealer relationships will remain unchanged for the time being. This suggests that while the Nikon Komodo Z is an exciting prospect, its release may not be imminent. The integration of two distinct company cultures and technologies takes time. Nikon will need to carefully navigate how to incorporate RED's unique image compression technology and cinema camera expertise into their existing product development and manufacturing processes. Similarly, RED will need to adapt to Nikon's approach to reliability and image processing. Despite the cautious approach, the potential of this partnership is undeniable. The combination of Nikon's expertise in product development and reliability with RED's innovative approach to digital cinema could lead to groundbreaking advancements in the field. The Nikon Komodo Z, if and when it materializes, could represent a new benchmark in hybrid, still video cameras. For now, the Nikon Komodo Z remains more of a tantalizing possibility than a concrete reality. But its very concept represents the exciting future of imaging technology. As the lines between photography and videography continue to blur, cameras like the hypothetical Nikon Komodo Z could become the new standard for visual creators across all fields. As we await further developments, one thing is clear. The acquisition of RED by Nikon has set the stage for a new era in digital imaging. 
Whether through the Nikon Komodo Z or other future products, this partnership promises to push the boundaries of what's possible in both still photography and cinematography. The industry watches with bated breath, eager to see how this fusion of two imaging powerhouses will reshape the landscape of visual storytelling. So what do you think? Share with us in the comment section below. Subscribe for more content like this, and as always, thanks for watching.